Hi everyone, it's James in Japan. It is April 17th, 2022. It's about 8.20 a.m. It's cool, it's 11 degrees Celsius. I'm out jogging, I'm heading down to the seaside, which is that way. See you down there. I'm at JR Michael Station. It's behind me and the sea is in front of me. That's the Akashi Strait and that is the Akashi Kaikyo Bridge. Down there is Route 2 called Mikokusen that goes eastbound and the other way goes westbound. So I'm going to head down to the uh, seaside. If you ever get to this area, you'll see that there's a lot of open space here and joggers. That is a museum. It, it talks about the construction of the Akashi Kaikyo Bridge that links Awaji Island to the main land. This is Kobe, Kobe Akashi. You see fishermen or fisherwomen or fisher people. You're allowed to fish for free anytime in Japan anytime here and probably most at most places in Japan you don't need a license just come down and fish take it home catch the fish and then cook it it's turning out to be a nice day down there is Akashi City Awaji Island and you can't see Kobe downtown Sanomiya Osaka is that way Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts. I see mainly Boy Scouts here. Do you see that Western looking house? A long time ago, Westerners lived uh, in a designated area. It's closed today. There's another old house, old fashioned house. Someone used to live there, someone prominent. Something's going on over there. Anyway, so like Kabuki. That looks haunted. <laughs> well, not in daylight. More fishermen. Fisher people, Boy Scouts. It's turned into some kind of restaurant. I've never gone in it. Oh yeah, this is the back side. The front side is on the other side. Anyway, this is down here. This is a historical site. Westerners used to live in designated areas in Kobe. This part of the beach has washrooms and in the summer time there's a confectionery shop. You can have free showers here. I think swimming will be permitted this year. I think they had signs on the beach that said no swimming. I just heard a rumor that they will lift that ban. Let's head down. Playing in the sand is no problem. I don't see a sign. I don't see any signs over here saying that you can't go into the water. I think I saw signs here last year that said no dipping in the water as well. Who knows? They might enforce that again. Hopefully they'll lift that ban altogether. But it looks like it's a goal. It's beautiful down here. It's a beautiful sunny day here in Kobe. And in the distance, you can't see it, is Mitsui Outlet Park. And that's where I'm headed. And that'll be the end of this video once I get there or even before there. 
I'm going to work on my lotto six numbers and numbers three and four. Prediction for tomorrow, that's April 18th. Sorry guys, I couldn't resist this shot. It is a stellar day. It's beautiful. Look at this. Don't you want to come down to Kobe and check out the Akashi Kaiko Bridge? Behind me is Mitsui Outlet Park, also called Marine Pia Kobe. They open at 10. They've got lots of good shops there. So if you ever get down to Kobe, check out this area. I'm going to continue on jogging. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.